friends and thank you so much for tuning in to Glam Life Wig and Makeup Reviews. My name is Kristen and for those of you who are curious what I'm wearing today on my hair as well as my lips, um, lips today is this really beautiful pink uh, lip gloss by Makeup Revolution. It's their Sheer Brilliant and this is in the shade Dollhouse and I love it. It's really creamy, really shiny and it just um, Kind of has a little bit of a sweet cookie smell too, which I think is really fun around this time of year. And then for hair today, I've got on Jim, um, Ellen Villa Jamia Plus in the shade Bernstein Rooted. This is a gorgeous uh, curly shade, uh, curly style, and I have done a review on this one before. So if you check out my previous reviews, you will find a review on this super fun curly style. So today's video is one of my favorite um, videos that I like to do. Uh, this is a declutter style video. So I've been decluttering some items and I'm going to be shipping them out to my sister in California. That's where I like to ship um, my items to. And um, so I've got a big bag here full of lots of goodies. And I thought I'd just run through them all and show you what I'm, I'm decluttering for the time. Some small, some big, just kind of everything in between. So we have a Philosophy Renewed Hope in a Jar Skin Tint. This is a Whipped Water Gel Broad Spectrum SPF 20. Um, it's kind of a, it's more of like a foundation, kind of like a skin tint. Very creamy by Philosophy. And then we've got a Dr. Brandt. This is um, Dr. Brandt's. Let's see, DNA, there's an, a Dream Night Cream and a Time Reversing Cream. It helps with wrinkles, it plumps, it reshapes. There's a, a night cream in this bag, there's a day cream, and then there's also another tube called Look Fabulous Not Frozen, and I'm trying to figure out, it's like a wrinkle line smoother, so um, I'm gonna send that out to her. She can check it out, I've never used it before. Um, and I thought it would work pretty good for her. Then I've got like a sample here. I get these all the time in my beauty boxes and in my Ulta orders. This is Estee Lauder and what's really cool about it is you're getting a sample of four different lip sh lipstick shades and then you also get a little um, a little lipstick brush in there that you can actually try on the lipsticks with. So I think that's really cool for it being a sample piece. We have a BH Cosmetics, yeah, BH Cosmetics Double Duty Six Piece Split Fiber Brush Set. Has a powder brush, flat contour brush, blush brush, rounded shadow brush, rounded blending brush, and small shadow brush. So it's a whole kit of brushes, and I know she loves those for putting on eye makeup and all kinds of fun stuff. I have a little sample of a liquid collagen lip by Alginist. I get these in my Ulta orders and Sephora orders. Um, that's where I get most of my samples is from Sephora and Ulta when I am ordering things. We have a whole bag of goodies here and I'm not going to go through every single one of them. Um, I've got mainly a lot of lipstick products in here. I've got several books and lip glosses. Um, I got my sister turned on to those. She loves them. They're wonderful. They have that tingly, that slight tingly peppermint feel, and they just feel great on the lips, especially around the winter months when it's getting really dry and our lips are getting drier. I love those kind of glosses. Um, there is a, let's see, there's a Drunk Elephant La La Retro Whipped Cream, a little moisturizer. There is a bottle here of some Makeup Revolution Skin Conditioning Oil. I've got several other lip glosses by ColourPop and Tarte and then several Buxom and a Maybelline Superstay, a Doll 10 lipstick, a Northern Light Sample Primer and um, I think there's a couple of All May lipsticks in there and a Bare Minerals lipstick. I like to put them all together, the small items in this little bag like that and then I just zip it up you know like that and it stays really good for the ride out to California but this is also a great way that you can gift things um, when I like to make gifts I like to put them in little bags like this and you can kind of tie this with a ribbon and it makes really fun you can do like um, one Christmas I put like a mascara 
and a lip gloss and like a face mask and some foot mask and I tied it together and something like this and mailed it out. It makes a really great way to gift it because it's like already already giftable and then you can wrap this or just leave it alone. But I like to do things like this for gifts and then kind of put like a spa day package together or a care package. Um, and that's really fun to send to my sisters like with little things that they can use um, on a day off or just to pamper themselves, a spa time. Those are things that I like, things that I would use um, that make you feel beautiful. And the things that I think really help, especially with spa day, is like your the, the bath bombs are wonderful, the um, foot masks are wonderful, the hand masks, the face masks, all the things that you can spend a day pampering yourself with. And then mascara is always a nice treat. And I think a lip balm or a lip gloss thrown into those gift, gift packages uh, like this are really nice, especially for the holidays, because it's like you're treating them to uh, a day to pamper themselves. And I think that that's just a really fun gift idea. So wanted to share that out there with you. I've done that in the past, and I'm sure I'll probably do it again this year. We have another sample of some Laura Mercier lipsticks. I am gifting her my Tarte. I've had this for a while. It's a color wheel, and it's the Amazonian Clay Blush Palette. Um, I have a lot of blush. This is a beautiful outside packaging, um, but I have so many blushes, and so I just wanted to go ahead and pass this along. It has, um, let's see, three, five, six, seven. It's got ten different blushes in it, and they're all powder blushes, and they're all really, really pretty. So I think she'll really enjoy that and get get the rest of the use out of it. I've had fun using it. This is a Pharmacy Skin Dew Hydrating Essence Mist and Setting Spray with Inconesia Green, Green Envy. It's a hydrating essence mist that tones the skin, restores radiance, and freshens makeup. So it's like a makeup spray um, that you can put on after you've done your makeup. And I'm going to go ahead and pass that along to her. And I've got a small sample of Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair for all skin types. It is an anti-aging serum, and um, my sister is at that age where she can use these type of, you know, products better than I can. She will get more use out of them um, than I will because of, you know, wrinkles and things like that that this will help with. Where uh, So I like to pass these products along to her. We all know that Estee Lauder can get really expensive and most of the time I get these samples if I order like lipstick or other products from Estee Lauder and sometimes Ulta, mostly Ulta and Sephora. Um, as we all know, you can get lots of samples from them and so they just throw this in my packaging and then I save whatever I'm not going to use and send it along to her. So that's a lot of fun and it helps her out tremendously. Then we've got um, another little Buxom gloss here. These Buxom glosses are what I was talking about. These are amazing. Um, this one's in the shade Strut It, and I like to pass those along to her just so she can enjoy them. She loves them, and I love them too. This one here is Laura Geller's uh, Baked Gelato Lace Illuminator in Ballerina. This is a really gorgeous highlighter. It's kind of a goldish tan color and it's beautiful with a clear packaging. So I'm passing that along. Then we have an Estee Lauder Take It Away Makeup Remover Lotion. This is really great for uh, taking your makeup off at the end of the day. So it's just a small travel size tube of that. I have a Physician's Formula Rose All Day Oil-Free Serum that brightens and tightens. I love this stuff. Um, I actually have a couple more bottles of this. I use it quite frequently. Um, but I wanted to pass it along to her so she can try it. It's a great serum that I like to mix in with foundation or even before foundation. It's oil-free, uh, perluminous formula, helps tighten and brighten skin for a radiant glow. It's enriched with rose water to help soothe, calm, and hydrate skin. And it's formulated with antioxidant-rich goji and kakadu plum, the richest vitamin C source of any fruit. It can be used alone, under, or over makeup. And I've used this all three ways and I think it works great with your foundation mixed in or under or on top. Um, it just kind of gives a little bit of an extra glow and but not over the top. So excited to try that out, uh, have her try that out and I think she'll really enjoy it. So next we have a couple of samples here, another Drunk Elephant and uh, Lip Collagen sample. 
I have a little tiny Mary Luminizer from The Bomb. The Bomb Cosmetics makes some really cute vintage items. I have a little tiny, little tiny highlighter here. And it's got the Mary Luminizer highlight in it. So I think that's adorable and I know she'll enjoy that. She loves those cute little packaging. These are great for travel. They're, they work great in your travel bag and I love them as well. Then we have a Laura Geller Baked Eclipse Eyeshadow Duo in Champagne Caviar. So it's a baked eyeshadow and it's got a couple of different colors mixed together. And that's a lot of fun. I have another Booksum Lip Gloss and this one's in Pucker Up. It's like kind of a light lavender color. Then we have a Tarte Exquisite Lip Surgeons Liquid Lip Shine. Really unique packaging on that one. Kind of has that mosaic packaging. I love, I love a lip product that has packaging like this because it looks so nice out on your makeup desk or just in with your uh, makeup and things like that. I've got a uh, Cary Grand Lip Whip, and this is a, it's in a little t tub like this, and then when you open it, it's got the lip whip inside, and it has a slight peppermint smell, so that's a fun one to use um, under lipstick or like at nighttime when you're going to bed. We have a sample of a V Saint Laurent Rouge Pure Couture lipstick so it's like a small sample of that and then I've got another Tarte palette that I'm sending off to her this also has really nice kind of like a matte packaging on the front and then when you open it you have a blush in the middle and several different eye shades so there's eyeshadow a highlight a bronzer and then a, a blush uh, in the middle it's called ladies night and it's a clay palette. So that's really fun to have. Let's see what else we have. I've got several samples here. I've got this Teamy Soothe Tea Infused Oil. It's got lavender and sage in it. Um, this has some really nice like actual tea leaves in it. Um, it's supposed to be really good for the skin and you can uh, I'm not sure there's not a lot of instructions on this I don't remember where I got it but you can actually it's like a face oil so you could mix it with foundation or just wear it as it is I'm gifting a, a no photos please 10 super intense eyeshadows um, this is by makeup revolution it's got kind of like a holographic look to it and then there's several different eyeshadows on the back Okay, I've got a, tar a Tatcha, the Dewy Skin Cream Ultra Hydrating and Anti-Aging uh, with Replenishing Japanese Purple Rice. This is an amazing uh, moisturizer. If you're looking for a new moisturizer and you want a really good one, um, the Tatcha Water Cream and the Tatcha Dewy Skin Cream are both amazing moisturizers. They are two of my absolute favorites. Um, it says this smooth cream envelops skin with rich hydration and seals in moisture while nourishing botanical extracts impart a dewy glow. It's formulated without parabens, synthetic fragrances, mineral oils, sulfate detergents, uh, phthalates, urea, DEA or TEA. It's excellent, it smells wonderful. I've used this many, many times as well as the water cream and I just absolutely adore it. And then I also have a Too Faced La Matte Color Drenched Matte Lipstick in the shade Bachelorette. It's one of their matte lipsticks. The box is awesome on the outside. It's got like a peacock on the side. Really cute packaging on that. Too Faced is known for their beautiful packaging. Um, got a Tom Ford Metalik little perfume. Then we've got a Belief Aqua Bomb Jelly Cleanser. This is a really good cleanser. Would work great with any type of um, you know, face, nightly face wash to clean your makeup off. It's just a great, um, takes away the impurities and it's a nice cleanser. Got a little bottle of the Olay Ultra Moisture Shea Butter Body Wash. These are also great for travel. They're just little small sizes. And then we've got a Clinique 
Beyond Perfecting Foundation Plus Concealer. This is a small sample size of it. I've used this foundation before in the bigger tube and I love it. This is in the shade 2.3 for dry combination to combination oily skin. I'm also gifting her my Too Faced Summer Eyes. I have gotten quite a bit of use out of this. The packaging again is gorgeous. Um, this is an eyeshadow palette and I have used it and now I'm just passing it along to her so she can get the rest of the use out of it. All right, so then we've still got a few more things left. I have another Laura Geller Baked, uh, Baked Eclipse Eyeshadow Duo in Moonlight Aubergine. And this is another one of those um, mixed together type of eyeshadow that is baked into the palette, which is nice. I have another Buxom Lip Gloss in the shade Cha Cha Cha. And then we, I'm sending her my Urban Decay All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray. This is one of the best setting sprays for all day staying power. Um, this is an excellent one, and this is just a small travel size of that. Then we have a Bare Minerals Punchy Melon. This is their Mo Marvelous Moxie Buttercream Lip Gloss, and it's in a really pretty shade. I also have a Tarte eyeshadow palette called Buried Treasure. The outside of the packaging is beautiful. I think that Tarte and Too Faced really have some some gorgeous packaging and this is no exception. It's got some really cute and fun colors mixed in there. All right, I just have a couple of items left. Um, I'm sending her my Bare Minerals Bare Pro Performance Wear Liquid Foundation in Cashmere. I've um, gotten a lot of use out of this, but I have several foundations I'm wanting to use up, so I'm passing that one along. And then also my Bare Minerals Gin Nude Eyeshadow Primer, because I've got um, several other primers I need to use up. And then I've got a Eyes Lips Face Rose. Um, this is a lip scrubber. These are the best lip scrubbers, the ones by e.l.f. They have uh, granules in the in the product that actually does really help to buff away the dead skin from your lips. So um, the Eyes Lips Face, these are very inexpensive. They're like three dollars on uh, e.l.f.'s website and I love these. Um, they're the best that I have found that work for lip scrubbers for your lips. So I really like that. I also have a Too Faced Polite Lips Polite and Pretty Lip Gloss in the shade see the shade on this. I don't think it has a shade, but it's just like a light, shiny, um, sheer lip gloss by Too Faced. And then last but not least, we do have a Coastal Scents Revealed palette. There's 20 eyeshadow colors in here. I think she'll have a lot of fun with this. It is a um, palette that has a lot of neutrals in it. So I'm passing that along. Um, color, or I'm sorry, Coastal Scents has a lot of good eyeshadow palettes that are very inexpensive as well as ColourPop and uh, BH Cosmetics. They all have some really good um, inexpensive eyeshadow palettes that um, even can compare to say some of the dupes for Urban Decay. So um, I do like a lot of their eyeshadow palettes and will review some in upcoming videos. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this declutter video. I like to go through my collection every once in a while and I just start putting things in a bag and then I send them out to her. Um, I have a lot more decluttering to go through, but I, I felt like the bag was getting heavy and there was quite a few items in there. So I wanted to go ahead and shoot a video on that so you can see what I'm getting rid of, passing along. Uh, most of those products I like. Um, it's just that I'm always rotating and getting new items in my collection, so I like to pass them out to her and let her get some use out of them um, before their life is over. So it's just fun to uh, pass it along and then she can experience it and see if it worked different or better for her. So um, again, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for tuning in. If you like this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to click the red subscribe button down below if you're not already subscribed to my channel. I do post um, videos on makeup and 
alternative hair um, at least two to three times a week so um, stay tuned if you love alternative hair uh, definitely want to subscribe because I do focus a lot on wigs and the different styles that I have so excited to share that with you um, also in the description box down below if you click the little down arrow you will find um, several links you will find a, a link to my sister's channel it's called daily dazzle and dawn stamper she has a lot of awesome alternative hair reviews that you would uh, love to check out and I think you'll really enjoy them also um, there's a link to my eBay store where I do have uh, things posted for sale and then you'll also find a link to my to follow me through Instagram as well as Facebook and then there's a link to my um, email address if you would like to send me a comment or suggestion or a video idea something that you'd like to see um, definitely send me that email and I will uh, be happy to to work with you and respond to you it's really a joy to have such uh, dear friends here through my channel so again thank you so much for watching and I will see you very soon in my next video. Bye!